We have been following this reno since last year, and I cannot wait to see the latest update. Mike, I'm always impressed. How are you, and how are things looking? Hi, Tracy. I'm great. Uh, things are really coming along. There's been lots of little hurdles along the way, given the environment, but uh, we're right on track, and uh, it's looking really, really good. Listen, you are a man who gets things done, and I am so invested in this. <laughs> I can't wait to see what's new. So let's start with the main floor. What is the update there? Well, the main floor, as you can see behind me, the sliding unit is finally in, and I'm going to open it up. If you take a look, Ooh. all the mill work is now on site, <clears throat> and that is the next two weeks, is putting in the kitchen and the built-ins and the vanities and all that and the, throughout the entire house. And um, that's stage one. Stage two is actually getting the appliances, and that, that's going to be the hard part, given the delays in the industry right now and, and any appliances on any project are well behind. Yeah, we're seeing that with so many renos right now. Uh, you know, everything will stop until you can get that next step, and then you've got to stop again until you can get the next step, but eventually it will get done. I want to talk about those floors. They are beautiful. So exciting to see it all coming together. And I know the back of the house has completely changed. Where are you at with that? Well, the entire rear elevation, as I mentioned, the rear slider's in, the windows are finally in. We have one door that's still back ordered. And all the brickwork that's around me here was just delivered. But we usually send this off to the shop to have it cut to create outside corners and veneer brick. However, because of the fact that those shops are closed right now, we're cutting all of the brick on site to be able to move ahead with the exterior facade. Okay, so you're getting that all done too, and I've never seen like little edge pieces and end pieces cut out of the brick. Like you are a pro, so very excited. <laughs> wow, uh, it, it's not me; it's the mason. That's I'll take good. credit for it though any day. I'm excited uh, for the update on the second floor, Mike. So tell me about the ensuite walkthrough, the tub shower combination. Sounds amazing. It is, and it's actually really, really gorgeous. It was a, a very clever design by Hudson Cruz, and all the flooring's in, all the tiles complete, the trim is well underway, the interior doors are done. Uh, we're just waiting on the next steps will be final paint, hardware, uh, the bath accessories, and the final electrical. Those are the, the pieces that are up next. Uh, I know the original stairs were changed completely, so where are you now with that? Well, the stairs are all in. And uh, they're all protected to be used during construction. And, and the next piece of that is the railings. They've all been templated, and we'll have those in time. You know, the challenge has been through all of these different pieces is, is to stay busy throughout. So moving from, you know, one section of the house to the other, one floor to another, one task to the next, um, and being able to pivot during, you know, all the different challenges that we're, we're seeing but we've, we've managed to stay very productive throughout and the team has been incredible the subs have been excellent and and like i said we are on track so cool to see that progress 